the main theme is a simple one. It's how to use the mind to skillfully change the brain, to change the mind for the better. That's it. In other words, it's the power of self-directed neuroplasticity. The idea that with growing understanding of the circuits and processes in the brain that are underneath positive, useful thoughts, feelings, desires, behaviors, when we understand those circuits better, we can directly stimulate them with mental activity alone. Well, I think one thing that makes my writing interesting, at least to me, is that I go back and forth between being very amazed at the brain and the mind and how it works together and fascinated by it, and at the same time bring it back to, okay, practical. How can I use this material? How can it inform me and be useful for me? And I think that's a good test because if it's not practical, uh, it's good, it's interesting, but uh, if you cannot use it to help people, I think something is missing. So this new book is about the power of everyday experiences, walking down the street, spending time with your friends, relaxing with a meal, the power of ordinary experiences to build strengths inside your own brain and how to actually do that and defeat the Stone Age brain tendency to focus on the negative and not learn very well from the positive.